move on to Navy and Central Florida. Uh, UCF, 16 and a half point home favorites, 53 the total in this game. Central Florida, huge win against Tulane, very impressive. Uh, they could not uh, stop uh, Tulane, I should say, could not stop uh, the ground attack of uh, UCF in that game, and that ended up being the difference uh, in the end. But now you're coming off the high of that win, and that, look, you're back in the bounce house. You've been good at home this year, five and one straight up, four and two ATS. But you're laying a big number here, uh, and you know you're playing against a Navy team that, in the underdog role here these last couple weeks, you know the Navy, Cincinnati ten point loss is eighteen and a half point dogs. Notre Dame last week. Again, what you get from service academy squads is a team that battles and competes for the whole 40 uh, or for the full 60 minutes, I should say. And that's exactly what you saw. They lose 35 to 32 uh, against Notre Dame. I mean, this Navy team has definitely improved as the season's gone along. Uh, the UCF defense this year, the one concern is the run defense is a strength for UCF on that side of the ball. And that plays well against the triple option on the flip side. Uh, you've got this uh, UCF uh, run game, which has been great, but obviously Navy, uh, with, with the way they operate, you know they have to try to shut down and be disciplined in their run defense, and they have pretty good run defense numbers this year, which might be able to offset what UCF wants to do offensively. But uh, at the same time, I don't know if Navy's face-to-ground attack as good as Central Florida when you look at some of their previous opponents. That being said, again, this is not a UCF spot. Coming off one of their biggest wins of the year, you saw the way Gus Malzahn was uh, celebrating there after they got the uh, game clinching stop uh, against Tulane last week. It's a lot of points to be laying when the spot is a little bit of a negative one uh, for UCF. And all Navy's done the last couple of weeks is hang around getting points in this range. So I'm definitely leaning midshipmen here uh, early in the week, getting 16 and a half here uh, in this game.